Breaking tonight in Brunswick, a huge response as multiple fire departments are at the scene of an explosion and fire at a warehouse near the city's port. Thank you for joining us at 11. I'm Jeff Vallon. That explosion and fire were reported earlier tonight at Mayor's Point in the city's port area. Brianna Ray Turner is on your side joining us live from the scene. Brianna, what are you seeing right now? Yeah, now if you take a look behind me, the fire is still going on. I just I was here about an hour ago, and if you take a look behind me, the fire and flames are still going on in the warehouse. Now, you know, firefighters and uh, have been trying to put this fire out. Brunswick police officers still blocking off roads right now on Newcastle Street. Now, neighbors say this warehouse warehouse has been um, on fire since around 8 p.m., but they also said this building has turned on fire before. Now, neighbors say the last time it took days for firefighters to put it out the last time put out the fire. But one neighbor, Chris Murray, says it's frightening to hear the noises coming from the warehouse. If you were to hear it in the background now, you hear it popping and um, starting to fire. It's starting to collapse again. And just the heat from itself is, is pretty enormous. Now I'm just going to walk around a little bit and show you what we're seeing. We're going to turn over here, DJ, if you turn over here. We got neighbors. They were outside wondering exactly what's happening. Uh, you can smell also the smoke. If you look in the air, if you tilt up the camera a little bit, if you sm the smoke is still surrounding the building. Um, you know, firefighters were coming out here, going to the fire hydrant. Now there is something that I did get tipped on by a neighbor who told me that the fire hydrants near the warehouse um, are, aren't really, they don't really work. Um, and so that's why they had to use the fire hydrant outside of the warehouse. Now that's something to note, which is why maybe it's taking longer than usual for it to um, for the firefighters to put the fire out. Now that is all the information we know right now. Like again, we did confirm that it was an explosion um, and First Coast News will keep you up with the latest I'm live in Brunswick. Brianna Ray Turner, First Coast News on your side. Brianna and we will keep you